Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Hussain Kazi here. Hello to all AFM students. I hope all of you are doing well. A very warm welcome to my AFM September 24 first live session. The agenda of this particular session is exclusively exam preparation strategy. With this session, we will only discuss about what's the right strategy for the preparation of your upcoming AFM exam. So, what are the key points for the agenda? If we really wanted to develop the right strategy for AFM exam preparation, we need to cover first four points. Number one, we have to aware about the exact schedule of the exam and of course the duration from now, the total duration from now. Number two, how the course will execute. Number three, how to kick start your AFM course. Number four, how you will invest your time, how you will invest your time. And number five, your questions. Any of the question you can ask the technical side of the syllabus, whatever the part of syllabus you have covered till now, or any soft question about the above four points. So let's start with the key agenda point number one. Students, now is 22nd of June. Now is 22nd of June. AFM exam schedule for September 24. That's that's Friday. Sorry, that's Friday, 6th of September. Friday, 6th of September. The total duration from now, from now means from 22nd of June. That's approximately 10 weeks because 11th week will you are will be yours exam week so duration that's 10 weeks so you can split you can split your time with these two manners <clears throat> or you can split the 10 weeks with afm exam preparation for eight weeks and revision mocks revision and mocks for two weeks so this is what about the schedule, duration, and you have to invest your time with this 8 and 2. That's 80, 20, that's 80% time you will invest for exam preparation and 20% time for the uh, revision and the mocks. Number two, the course execution, the course execution, how the course will execute. Students, very important point. very important the course structure or the course execution based on three parts of course this course is a the coverage of the course is a collective effort by me and you and this collective efforts based on three components number one the first part is afm concept building the first part is AFM concept building. Number two, AFM question practice course. And number three, AFM assignments and mocks. So I'm going to explain the course structure one by one. What is the meaning of concept building? Students, if you really wanted to get success of your upcoming AFM exam. You need to aware the very important thing that there are three important variables to get success. The first variable to get success is about knowledge of entire syllabus. Knowledge of entire syllabus. And we will cover the knowledge with this AFM concept building. Knowledge. Number two, concept 
building in the 100% knowledge is not enough to pass your exam. But and the, sorry, to get the success of a AFM exam, the concept building or the syllabus coverage, it's not good enough. But you also need to learn about the exam techniques. So number one, with this concept building course, you will cover the entire knowledge of the syllabus. Number two, with this question practice course, you will be able to learn the exam techniques, including time management, including marks management, including professional skill marks. So both the things you need to learn, concept building and exam techniques with question practice course. Number three, you know very well, coverage of course is important, but also the revision assignments, mocks, that means your progress evaluation. That means your progress evaluation is still important. Your progress evaluation is still important. So, your efforts must have to put with respect to the assignments and the mocks as well. So, three key variables to get success. Concepts, 100% knowledge, question practice scores and exam techniques, assignment, mocks and revision. Now, one by one. The first thing is that the student registered with me, I have categorized with two parts. The students registered with my course with English. So you have registered with Hussain So all of you must have to cover the concept building course according to the roadmap. According to the roadmap. But the student registered with me for my AFM Urdu courses, Urdu language courses, have to cover the syllabus or have to develop the concept to follow the lectures available on the e-academy portal. That's a key point. <clears throat> so, the student who have registered with my English course that with wasankadi.com have to follow the roadmap. What's the roadmap? This is what about the roadmap. Number one, these are the important instructions and these are the specific dates that's mentioned here. For example, by upcoming days, that's 25th of June, I'm expecting that you people will be able to cover the revision of NPV and VAC the topic APV and the topic of the format and the topic of NP. That is topic I'm expecting that you be you people need to cover by upcoming 25th of June. If you have already covered, that's very good. So students who have registered with me with the E Academy lectures, so have to follow the instructions of the board. Do remember you have to strictly follow these deadlines. That's very important. Number two, the second important thing that is about exam technique course. That is about exam techniques. That's AFM Question practice course that includes the learning of time management, marks management, plus professional skill marks. What I I mentioned here, professional skill marks, PSMs, professional skill marks. 
this is what about the AFM question practice roadmap. This is the separate course. Huh? So this course, where this course available, I will provide you the access of the AFM question practice course by first week of July. By first week of July. Don't worry. How you will be able to get access? Leave it. I will provide the access. Don't worry. This question practice course is something about digital revision kit. It's something about digital revision kit. For example, if there's a question of the Robson pass exam question, Robson. So lecture 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, it's about It's about the discussion of this question, including the discussion of calculation and theory with MS Excel or CV format. This course, it's not only about the video lecture, but also includes suggestive answers. Suggested answers means student caliber answers. So this course is very much important. Huh? So number one, Number one, concept building. Number two, coverage of concept building. That's a knowledge of syllabus. Number two, exam techniques. Number two, exam techniques with the AFM QPC course. Number three, assignment and mocks. I will provide you the topical assignments or topical assignments. You have to follow the instruction on the WhatsApp huh? on the WhatsApp group. That's with the totality of the course that 8 to 10. And these mocks, these mocks, I strongly suggest you need to mark these dates on your calendars. There will be Three mocks with this course and zero percent tolerance. Zero percent tolerance. That's I will not tolerate if any one of you not participate with this mocks. I I'm going to announce a very I'm going to announce now with the start of the course and you need to follow these instructions. Mock one, that's called mid mock. That's that's will that's will conduct by 20th of July. Saturday, 10th of 20th of July. Mock 2. What is the name of the mock 2? Copycat mock. What is the name? Can you please repeat? Can you please share me the name? What is the name of the mock 2? Can you write it and reply me? Copycat mock. Yes, copycat mock. Mock 2, copycat mock. Copycat mock. That's when we have, that's, I will conduct on 10th of August, Saturday. Mock 3, ACC September 24th. That's will conduct by 25th of August. 24th of August. Mock 3, actually this Mock 3, it, that it's about uh, the ACC pre-mock and ACC will publish this pre-mock by mid of August. But I will conduct that, that particular mock by 24th of August. You have to participate, your role is to participate the mock. My role is to provide the feedback of the mock. Me and my academic team will provide the feedback to you for this mock. That's a one. Is this clear? Can you please apply me? Can you please apply me? Can you please apply me? I'm waiting for it.
थैंक यू वेरी मच ओके बट आई ऑल्सो वॉन्टेड टू शेयर अ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट थिंग है अ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट थिंग है आई वॉन्टेड टू शेयर स्टूडेंट्स स्टूडेंट्स एफ एम एग्जाम इज एक्चुअली द कॉम्बिनेशन ऑफ थ्योरी एंड कैलकुलेशन फॉर थ्योरी you will face 60% and calculation you will face 40% so from today you have to bear in your mind that whatever the time you will invest 60% time 60% time must have to invest for theory and 40% time for calculation 60% time you need to invest for theory and 40% in term of calculation once again i'm asking how much the exam how much the theory will you will face with the exam can you please reply me Sixty. Yes. Just take take a screenshot. Just take a screenshot and take out the printout and the hard copy and paste in front of your study table or attach as a wallpaper with your mobile and the laptop or the desktop. That sixty percent you will face as theory and forty percent for calculation. so you and me have to develop a strategy to cover the exam to cover the slippers to make a revision in a manner that's the ability must have to develop to attempt 60% theory and 40% calculation i hope it's very clear to you sir how to cover the theory the strategy what we should do to cover the theory all the calculation part we know that we will work out number 1 notes reading whatever the notes ex the notes i have provided with you you have to read the notes number 2 number 2 kaplan six chapters kaplan six chapters these six chapters chapter number 1 3 4 5 9 12 12 that's all only six chapters just make a quick review you need to read this chapters like you read yeah, like you read <coughs> like you just read the newspaper just for the knowledge not for the not for not for the learning something you don't need to read these chapters in a manner to mug up anything to learn anything just for the basic knowledge just for the basic knowledge and number 3 and number 3 drafting practice reference point afm qpc whatever the guidance i will provide i will provide with my question practice course how to draft theory 
with the exam techniques about time management, marks management and professional skill marks. You have to draft the answer in this manner. So how to cover theory? Notes reading, Kaplan 6 chapters reading and drafting practice. Reference my AFM question practice course. Is this clear? Can you please reply me? Is this clear? Can you please reply me? Is this clear? So what we have done with the agenda point, number one, we have covered with the schedule and duration. Number two, we have covered the course structure. The course structure that includes concept building, question practice course, assignment in mocks, and make sure that you have to develop the strategy in a manner to cover the theoretical aspect as well. And the strategy to cover the theory I have mentioned, I have mentioned here. Now, what the next point? Kick start the course. How to kick start your course? Kick start your AFM course. Sir, What, what is the right point to start our course? You have to start this course with these two videos. Number one, what inside the course that is about AFM orientation, very comprehensive orientation. Huh? What inside the course, what inside the course? You have to watch this video very carefully. This video includes all syllabus components or exam, uh, sorry, includes all the, or, sorry, includes study approach of financial management, AFM, advanced financial management, the syllabus content, the passing rate matters, the uh, further the exam practice, complete details, all the aspects. That's important. So AFM orientation that what inside the course. Number two, AFM smart study techniques. AFM smart study techniques. AFM smart study techniques. This video will provide you guidance. What's the exact technique you need to you need to focus to cover the syllabus of AFM to get and able to get success. That's a key point. So you need to kick start your AFM course with, by watching these two videos. Now, the very important point. How to invest your time? How to invest your time? Sir, how we will invest our time? Number one. First of all, we need to sort out. We need to sort out for what purpose we need to invest our time. For what purpose we need to invest our time? Number one, you need to invest your time for concept building. For concept building. Yes. For example, for concept building, you need to invest your 80 hours. 80 hours. And of course, this is approximately 80 hours. For question practice course, you need to invest your 40 hours. For notes reading, you need to invest for 20 hours. For assignment submission, you need to invest for 15 hours. For three mocks, 
assignment 20 hours. For three mocks, you need to invest for 10 hours. For self-practice, you need to invest for 40 hours. So that means the total hours you need to invest that's equals to 210 hours. Now, how to allocate these 210 hours? You have total eight weeks, as you know that. So if you require to total eight weeks to complete and practice the question, because the last two weeks is about practice and revision. So if we divide 210 with this eight hours, uh, eight weeks, so that means approximately 26 hours per week. And if you are not a full-time student, if you are <clears throat> if you are studying your if you are uh, you, <clears throat> if you study with your job, at least eight hours you need to invest for Saturday Sunday. Eight multiplied by two, eight per day multiplied by two. And for remaining 26 minus 16 divided by 4. Let's suppose that one day you will take rest. So two and a half hours per day. So you need to make a strategy in this manner. If you are a full time student, so you can make a strategy with your own pace and of course you will have a penalty of time you have more than the 210 hours huh? so students can you please apply me what do you say that is this reasonable or what you uh, what's your feeler here is it doable Yes, it's doable. If you really start your studies from now, you can do that. You will be able to, to complete the course in this manner within eight weeks. That's a point. So you the important point is that the important point is that you have to start your studies at right time. And this is the right time. Some of the students ask me that, sir, what if we will start studies of AFM after the, after June 24 exam result, when it's, when it's confirmed that uh, we will be able to pass with previous exam and then we will start for AFM studies. I don't recommend. Why? Because after three weeks, once the ACC result will publish at that particular time, the required hours to invest remain 210. But the remaining weeks, after three weeks, that's become five. So how it's possible that's 210 divided by five? 42 hours per week. It's not realistic. It's unrealistic. So it's better to start your studies from now with your, with your own pace and follow the roadmap, follow the portal lectures accordingly. Simultaneously, by start of next month, I will provide, I will give you the access of QPC. You have to start with the question practice course as well. If any of the student, if Let's suppose if any of the student not seriously start the studies from now and after three weeks, the student become able to pass your previous exam. 
so you will be happy for the previous previous exam that's become pass that you will be able to pass but you will not be happy about afm because now at that point you will be worried sir what i will do sir what i will do about this because uh, at that after 3 weeks you you uh, you will be you will be comfortable with your previous success of the exam but you are not you will at that particular time you will not be comfortable about the uh ap preparation even if someone asks me that if we start after the uh, exam uh, after the result will i be able will any one able to complete the course it's very much risky especially the students uh, student, uh, students who are not the full time students or engaged with the job so this is the right strategy that you need to cover students furthermore furthermore i will also provide a complete question grid with you so what question grid one moment yes one moment yes this is the complete question grid this complete afm questions grid are the total questions that you need to practice actually the relevant practice questions start from september 18 till september december 23 do remember that till now the the past paper available is with september december 23 but after the after 15 july acc will also publish the march june 24 exam paper will also publish march june 24 exam paper so we have good enough can pass exam paper of afm from september 18 till march june 24 not to worry and this is actually your revision grade i have <clears throat> made a complete question grid according to the content of the syllabus for example for advanced investment appraisal you need to cover the these 12 questions and of course this grid not includes the march 24 question i will add on once the acc will publish for equitation merger that's 13 to 24 the business reorganization that 25 to 33 forex 34 to 37 interest rate risk management 38 to 46 role of senior financial management in mnc 47 to 50 and other questions 51 53 these 53 questions plus march june 24 three more questions 56 plus my three mock exams that's good enough that's more than enough in fact that this practice material enough to get distinction for not only to get 50 marks you don't need to involve any revision cut just focus this can you please apply me is this clear to all of you so this is what about a session that's i push you to start the question or sorry to start your course the schedule and duration i have covered with this agenda point according to agenda the course execution the 
the question practice course uh, sorry um, concept building course plus question practice course plus mock exams plus theory handling number three how to kick start the AFM course with two videos how to invest your time I have developed a strategy of the time how to allocate your time accordingly don't worry you will get this um, Excel Excel file don't worry now it's about your questions your questions you can ask your questions any of the questions you can ask Yes, of course, the students who have registered with me will get this Excel file. Don't worry about that. All of the students who have registered with me will get this question grid. Don't worry about that. You can ask any of the questions. From where we get practice questions. I strongly suggest you have to watch this video. That's my orientation video. That's what inside the AFM course. Where I have already guided. I, I provide the I have already provided the guidance that uh, how to access the questions. Majority of the questions available with the CBE format with the CBE format. If the question is not available with the CBE format, I will provide with the PDF format. Don't worry. I will provide with the PDF format. The folder with the PDF format will be available. Don't worry. Yes. Anything else? You wanted to ask any question you can ask. Either the soft element about the discussion I have made or any technical aspects. If you have covered any part of the syllabus, you can ask. How much, Mohammed Abbas asked, how much theory is important in AFM paper to get passing marks? One sec, I have already told you earlier with this session that whenever, whenever you face AFM exam, so AFM exam, it's approximately 60% theory and 40% calculation. So you have to invest your time. Invest your time means for concept building, for question practice score, for notes reading, for assignments, for mocks, for self practice. All the time you need to invest, for example, 200, out of 210 hours, make sure you have to invest your 60% time for theory, 40% for calculation. Although without calculation, theoretical area is incomplete. Same same as the vice versa. Theoretical aspect is incomplete without calculation. So if you wanted to get just pass, even though you will face the same proportion of the questions. And my brother, my student, don't worry about the theory. Don't worry about the theory. We are we are human being, the special creature of God, Allah, the special creature of Allah, God. If we face any issue, so we have a, Allah has provided us the flexibility to adapt these things, the flexibility to learn the thing. The important thing is that don't get feared. Don't be afraid about the theoretical matters. Instead, Start reading, start drafting.
from today about the theoretical aspects any of the student can any can ask any question to me about the course including theory calculation checking of the drafting matters all the things regularly on regularly with the live session regularly with the live session regularly with the live session every saturday every saturday 8 pm or you can drop your questions on the whatsapp group whatsapp group don't message me personally share your message on whatsapp group relevant whatsapp group if because with whatsapp group message i will reply you quickly rather than individual because there are hundred of students and hundred of messages from my offices so not able to catch all the individual messages but i will definitely reply you if some of you ask the query on the whatsapp group i am a human being maybe sometime i note that message so you need to remind me once again but on whatsapp group even with the live session you can ask me another question you can check your answer about the theoretical so the point is not that to be afraid about the theoretical content instead of start working on it be your own hero to cover these things about the theory and the calculation is this clear Is this clear, Muhammad Abbas? So you must be motivated about that. Huh? Okay, another question. How would we retain information of just reading the six chapters? No, Mustaba. The first thing about, the first thing for the learning is about the reading. The first thing about the learning is the first step is to read important thing is that first of all read the material and get the knowledge you don't need to mug up anything if you have a knowledge i i can guarantee you if you face any of the fm question you will be able to start connect the things you will be able to start connect the things accordingly so obey my instruction start reading my notes for example the first topic with the roadmap is advanced investment appraisal first you cover the invest, advanced investment appraisal and then move quickly the reading of notes simultaneously read the six chapters you can invest your time in this manner six weeks each week one chapter each week one chapter for each chapter invest three to four hours maximum three to four hours just make a quick reading quick reading is this clear mustabhasan don't be afraid about retention in your mind it's not about a retention it's about the knowledge and the application i will provide you the guidance how to apply the thing but the first thing is that you have to work out in a way to start reading the content. Is this clear? Chapter number one, I, I know that in student each initially start reading the chapter one. That's that's you feel the that's you feel that's it's very boring, but don't be don't stop. You need to keep moving, keep moving, reading, reading, reading. Once you cover the six chapters and simultaneously covering the other part of the syllabus, mark my words, you will get confidence. Confidence about drafting the answer because you have knowledge in your mind. Then I will provide you guidance how to craft the knowledge whenever you're writing something. That's all. So is this clear?
Yes, any more thing you wanted to ask? You can ask me. Now the important thing is that you need to start your studies. That's the key point. Okay, now I'm going to conclude my session. Thank you very much for the participation of this session. The session has now become over. If you wanted to ask any question, you can ask me. I'm available next two minutes. If you don't have question, you can leave the session. Thank you very much. Take care a lot. Assalamu alaikum. You can ask me any of the question. I'm available next two minutes. I hope that this session is valuable for you. If yes, do reply me. Rest we will meet on next Saturday 8 p.m. Pakistan time. Yes, this lecture recording will be available. Any of the students can register with me for Urdu or English. It's up to you. Adin, you can contact me on the WhatsApp. Live session only, the, all the live session will conduct with the language of English. Yes, I have attached these chapters on this Excel file, the sheet number two. Kaplan chapters. I strongly suggest all of you that you have to subscribe my YouTube channel at least for the semester. Because some of the material I will upload on the YouTube, so you will be able or you will be able automatically to get updates. So at least for this semester, do subscribe my YouTube channel. I will share the link for the YouTube channel on the relevant WhatsApp group. Just some minute I'm sharing the link here. Yet now can you please Text me on the WhatsApp message. My WhatsApp number is my WhatsApp number is plus nine two three two one eight two seven one seven eight four.
वन मोमेंट Yes, you can subscribe with this channel. Okay, class. If you have any question, you can ask me on the WhatsApp. Thank you very much. Take care a lot. Assalamu alaikum.